welcome back to another video. And today we're doing another one of these classic unboxing videos like I usually do. But this one's going to be quite a big one, so stay tuned for this one. But today we're unboxing my first ever camera, y'all. It's been quite a long time since I've been filming on this one right here. But I decided to upgrade my quality and get this camera right here. So it's on the unboxing right now. Yeah, it's... Yeah, I just got this thing like this morning. It just arrived and I'm trying to... It's kind of hard to unbox this box though. Oh my god. What is this, bro? This is amazing. If there's anything else, the reason why I wanted to get a camera for my YouTube channel is just because I just need to upgrade my quality because I've been using the same crusty camera for the past three years and I just needed to, you know, have a change and stuff. Like, have more better quality for you guys because you guys deserve more better quality from me than anyone else in this, on YouTube. Here's the camera right now. Like, it looks pretty nice. I wanted to get it in all black, but this was like the cheapest price they had. The blacks went for more, so I just had to get this vintage look. And also, look at the lens, bro. And the lens just zoom out like this. That's amazing. And also, it's touchscreen. I just found out that it's a touchscreen camera. It's pretty cool. And also, it has a flip screen, so I'm just going to see you got it right now. I'm like, see, it has a flip screen, which is... Pretty nice, and also an embarrassing picture of my hand because this camera is touch screen. The camera froze. I think I might have broke my camera. I don't know, I'm gonna try it again. Um, yeah, so here's the camera. It has this little flip out screen, which looks pretty cool actually. It also came with some more accessories to this thing, like a tripod and a camera bag, and a charger. Yeah, and there's some more stuff in this bag right now. So, but it's really not that worth it. But to be honest with you, this camera is def it's a lot smaller than I expected, but I'm gonna tell you more about why I want this camera. Another reason why I wanted this camera is just so I can have a more smaller size whenever I'm going vlogging. Like usually when I'm vlogging, I'll bring this big heavy iPad and it just ruins my confidence while vlogging because everyone will stare at me. And if this thing's a lot smaller and I'm able to vlog better with this thingy. And also the quality on this thing is sick. I was just spinning it for like five minutes. It's gonna give you an update. This camera was not cheap at all. Like I saved up a lot of money to get this camera right here. Yeah, so after all my hard work paid off, I get this. Most of the mic comes separately, which is not really a good thing because I really need my mic now. So I can vlog in this camera and give you a better quality for my vlogs. So I've been using this camera for about 10 minutes. So far, first impression of this camera though is that the quality is very good. You know, so like sometimes I can switch by touching the screen too much, and then it does that. Like the high tech cameras are just sometimes can get a bit annoying though. And that's the end of the video. Please subscribe for more of this lit content though, and stay tuned for more of these videos because by the way, every Sunday, maybe even Wednesday, stay tuned for that as a video. Peace out.